lose everything. So I guess you won't be ambushing anyone else today. Ah, they got him! Man down!
Hey. Hey, man, how'd you do? Uh, this is all I could find. Oh. oh, man, what do we have here? Oh, brother, you're a lifesaver, dude. Right on. Thank you. Uh, do you need anything else, Weaver? Weaver, do you need... Totally. Mm, mm. Hey, Corporal St. John, you one of the good ones, man. Brother from another mother. That's it for now. Deke! Corporal! Hey! Sarge. Come on in. Take a look around. Okay, got it. Okay. Deke, uh, Corporal, uh, see you, man. Corporal Deacon St. John. Deer crossing, ah, uh, something's ever changed.
see. Uh, that'll hold. of these nests.
So, uh, what do you want from me, O'Brien? I'm glad she's alive, your wife. Okay, well, what do you want? I told you the infected, the freaks are mutating, some faster than others. Uh-huh. We placed a tracking bracelet on one of them so that we could track it and stop it periodically and draw blood samples and check the progress of the virus. Okay, so why do you need me? Well, it's wandered into militia territory. Oh, right. We can't get close to it. Yeah, no fly zone, outpost with RPGs. Exactly. What's this? Once you've tracked it down, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. This pack holds everything you need to do a field biopsy. We need blood and tissue samples. Can you handle that? Yeah, I can figure it out. By the way, nice uniform, Corporal. Suits you. Suck it. <laughs> Sounds like a whole lot of mumbo jumbo. Believe what you want. Once you see our test subject, you'll change your mind. O'Brien out. <sighs> O'Brien, I'm at the cave and I'm heading in. You guys gonna be ready? Yes, we're standing by. Oh, Jesus. What's wrong? Eh, freaker shit. Shit everywhere. Hey, O'Brien, uh, you got any idea what took out your men? Am I walking into a horde here? No idea. We never heard back from them. Remember, if you find them, we got people here who'd be grateful. Grateful? Oh, yeah, that changes everything. Yeah, I got it. Good. I'll take care of it. Out. O'Brien, how many men are in here? Uh, how many did you, did you lose? Four. Four men. A researcher and three soldiers. Jesus, O'Brien, what am I doing in here? The researcher, Coop, is a personal friend of mine. You do this and I'll do whatever I can to help you get your wife, O'Brien, out. O'Brien, so while I'm tracking down your pet freak, give me some more mumbo jumbo. Uh, tell me about the virus. I mean, something that I don't know. Was exposed, the virus infection rate is close to 100%. In the first weeks, almost everyone under the age of 12 was killed. Something to do with how puberty or the lack of it affected the body's immune response. Everyone over the age of 60 mostly were also killed. Their bodies just couldn't handle the rapid genetic mutations on a cellular level. Everyone else who was exposed becomes transformed as the genes mutate. The thing is, the virus is mutating at an exponential rate. I know you keep saying that. What does that mean? It means that the infected subject, the freaker you're tracking down, isn't like any you've seen before. We've tracked and identified over 12 mutations. 12? Yeah, and that's just the beginning. You wouldn't believe some of the shit we've seen. <sighs> yeah, well, I probably would. I'd say John out.
Well, Brian, I, uh, I reached your guy and, uh, yeah, he's dead. ID says G. Hernandez. How did it happen? Well, I'm not a coroner, O'Brien. How the hell do I know? Something tore him apart. Uh, this freak I'm tracking, is there something you haven't told me? Not that I'm aware of. O'Brien out. Brian, I found another one of your men. ID says his name was H.S. Patterson. Okay. Thanks for letting me know. You didn't ask, O'Brien. Didn't ask what? If he was alive or dead. This radio's been dead for 12 hours. All of their radios have been dead for 12 hours. I don't need to ask. Thank you for doing this. O'Brien, I'm out. Another flare. There, there's the last one. Brian, I uh, found another one. ID says his name was Robinson. Okay. Thanks. I'll let his family know. So, you guys have uh, families. You managed to get them all out while shit was going down? I'm not going to apologize for being lucky or luckier than most. Yes, some of us got our families out. Not many, but some. That's. Uh, that doesn't look good. Brian, I found your last man. ID reads Cooper. Copy that. Oh, no! Jesus. Oh, no! Hold up, he's still alive. Hold on. Hey, <laughs> Cooper, Cooper. Hey, 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 hey. Right here, right here. We're gonna get you out of here, right now. Cooper! Cooper, come in! <laughs> Sorry, shoot. Where's Seth? He's down. Come on. His legs are broken. Hold on, stay with him. I'm sending in another team. No, no, no. My, he's compromised. I'm not gonna make it. Hey. Let me talk to Jen. Get Jen in here now. Cooper, what the hell did this to you? What happened? I'm so fast. I just didn't see you coming. You told me that a freak did all of this. Reacher. Reacher. Cooper! Cooper, are you there? Jen? I'm here. I can't hear you. I can't you. believe it. I thought I'd never hear you more. Oh, look at me. We're gonna get you out of here. Do you hear me? Cooper! Cooper! Jen.
the hell am I dealing with here? Oh, man, I thought they... The guys in the lab nicknamed it the Reacher. Reacher? What is it? It's got long arms, claws, what? No, it's just... fast. We've clocked it moving 40 miles an hour. 40? Jesus. And yeah, it's strong. Maybe you should have... How would that not avoid anything? It is now, I said John out. O'Brien, I got your samples. Hey, John! Get out of there! What? Get out of there now! There's a horde coming! You've got to be kidding me! Shit, they're getting close. Yeah, it's time to finish these guys off.
Jesus, O'Brien. You made it out. Yeah, I made it out, no thanks to you. Transmitting coordinates. O'Brien out. O'Brien. Four men died for this shit. Hope it was worth it. Jesus, listen to you. Those are my men. I don't need you or anyone else telling me. Fly how. around in your helo well above the shit. You crawl back into the blood. Cozy underground bunker, whatever the fuck. You have no idea what it's like out here. I what it takes to survive. Oh, you know, those men, Cooper, the others, they had no idea what they were walking into, but you did. Didn't you? Huh? Didn't you? Radio me when you and your old lady are ready to be lifted out. Maybe this time you'll get on the chopper with her. Under patrol. Shit.
caution. Captain Curry tells me he was one of our best riders. If you let him get away, we will catch him. St. John out. Gotta take a closer look. Alright, where? Ah, you're mine now. Colonel has one. Oh, come on! You're not gonna make this easy on me, are you? Son of a bitch! Looks like you're having a chaotic day, yeah? Just the way you like it? Oh, you won't take me alive. Well, I think I already did. It don't matter much to me one way or the other. Goddamn the anarchists. Colonel, I've got him. Transmitting the coordinates now.
How long you been up here, huh? Setting up ambushes, hitting supply runs. Reporting in, did the uh, patrol get the prisoner?
something out of this.
Well, would you like to taste it? Go right ahead. Thank you, Corporal. I hope you were careful. This is very toxic. Yeah. Yeah, sure thing, ma'am. Uh, listen, I got a plan. I don't have time to explain, but the next time I get here, get ready to get the hell out of here, okay? Corporal. I didn't thank you this time. As you were. I have had a revelation. Last night, a new group of recruits joined our ranks and have already been sworn in. They have traveled far from the east, west, south, and north. They're coming to this place at this time. Is no accident. They bring word of more camps, like the one to the south which we have purged. Right. Yeah. Camps filled with degenerates, thieves, drug addicts, and murderers. We are threatened, all of us. Every day, we live in the shadow of death. Oh, yeah. right. But that shadow is not cast by rabid freaks that surround us. No, it's right. They are part of God's plan. That's right. yeah. They. Are part of God's punishment. Yes. Turn on yeah. No! Yes. No. It is not the freaks who threaten to destroy us. It is our fellow man. Yes, sir. Like Noah before us. We have built an ark to save mankind. To save all the knowledge. So when the flood waters recede, we may rebuild. Yeah. 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 But in this age, here at the end of the world, God is not sending the oceans from their beds to rise up and sweep away the damned. No. There will be no baptism of water. No. In this last age, we are the flood. We are sent forth to baptize the world with fire! Because we're doing this. We're doing this right now. Give me your coordinates. Done. Wait, where are you? Southern Crater Lake, Wizard Island, the militia camp. You've disabled the RPGs? Ah, oh, shit, not yet. I'll get right on that. Radio me when you're ready. I'll Brian out. Gotta get to the RPGs. Where would they be? Oh. Towers. It's gotta be the towers. Deacon, uh, Corporal St. John. Good to see you, man. Sarge.
That's right. Keep moving. Speech. Move it against other camps. Jesus, that's harsh. Come on, you son of a bitch. Yeah, right. That'll do it. I gotta get this arrow. Sarah, uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, come in. Damn it. Hang on, I'm coming. Can't you stand guard or do whatever it is you're doing out there? Colonel's orders. Gotta keep eyes on you at all times. Yeah, well, fuck the Colonel's orders. Hey, you watch your mouth. Things are changing around here. And if you don't follow the orders... <laughs> Make sure we're clear. You're good. You're clear. Okay. That's the plan. I need you to pack your stuff. We're leaving. How are we gonna get out of here? There are guards everywhere. Do you trust me? O'Brien. Well, I'm here. We're heading up to the cone. We got one shot at this. Copy that. O'Brien out. Who's O'Brien? Where are we going? Look, I don't have time to explain. You got everything? We're not coming back. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Right, stay close. And if we see anyone... Hey. In case you didn't read my note. So who's O'Brien? How's he getting us out of here? I told you O'Brien is how I found you. He was the Nero soldier who was there that night, the night that I put you on that chopper. Nero? Oh, come on! Oh, shit, Weaver! Out of the way. No, 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 that one. The canister. Right. Private! Are you paying attention? Eyes on your work, man! That canister, right there! I don't want to see that canister fall. Holy shit, he let us go. Weaver let us go. Oh shit, more guards. Okay, hold here. Hey, come on. Let's go around them. Okay. So, Brian, the guy in the Nero chopper, he's coming here? Yeah, look, it's a long story. I'll tell you all about it once we get clear. Wait, so they're still flying? I mean... Deacon, they must have resources, labs, equipment. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure they do. Look, you can ask O'Brien when you see him. Another guard. Hold on. I'll distract him. Yeah, I'll be careful. Soldier, what are you doing? Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. This area is off limits. How dare you talk back to the police? Do you know the penalty for disobeying an order? Do you know that we have hanged soldiers for less? You do know that, right? I was sent by the colonel, soldier. He's asked me to check on you, specifically you. He mentioned you by name. You got me. Another guard. I'll see if I can get them to move. 
I'll be careful. Well done. Come on. We're almost there. I can't wait to see Boozer again. You, uh, you want to go with me? To Lost Lake, I mean? I mean, I, th I thought we were going to Cloverdale. No, you are. I mean, I just want to see him. He's like my big brother. I don't know, it's not like we have much family left these days, you know? You got me. Bruiser again. You, uh, you want to go with me? To Lost Lake, I mean? I, mean, I, th I thought we were going to Cloverdale. No, you are. I mean, I just want to see him. He's like my big brother. I don't know, it's not like we have much family left these days, you know? Who's out there? Soldier, over here, please. Ma'am, this is restricted. Are you questioning me, soldier? Do you see this ring? Huh? Do you know that I can have you court-martialed for instant- <laughs> Nice. You too. I can see daylight. Come on, we're almost out. Yeah, okay, this is it. We're at the cone. He'll be here. He'll be here. We just, uh... Oh, need to... Gentlemen, this is the top of the cone where you can see we get an amazing view here. Oh, Lieutenant. I've just been giving this group of new recruits a tour of the island. Oh, we're just about to go down into the Ark. You should join us. Uh, well, uh, gentlemen, Colonel... this is Lieutenant Whitaker. She heads up part of the research team that's exploring ways to use poison to defeat our enemies. Traitor! Why would you, you listen to him over I me? You you know I am not. like the leader of that camp, Lost Lake, oh, sent this him is here. Full of shit. I'm telling I, you. I've never even met this motherfucker. Colonel, you've got to believe me. Enough! All right. I'm listening. I am telling you, he is a spy. Matt, this guy's crazy. You've never seen him before. Yeah. He comes out of nowhere and you're going to believe what, what's him? What's that camp you're saying I'm from? You think Lost I'm lying? What the is that it? I'm not lying. Have him show us your back. Yeah. Huh? Show us your enough, back. enough! That's my last warning. Now we will get to the truth of this matter. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. Captain Corey, I forget, is that the eighth or the ninth command? I don't rightly recall, sir. Tell me what you saw and don't lie to me, son. I'll know. At Lost Lake Camp, he attacked a woman. What the fuck are you- Barbara! He wasn't wearing a shirt. Son of a bitch has a tattoo covering his back. Some satanic shit. It's some kind of dog, a dead dog chewing through a chain or something. Like it was nothing. I, I pulled him off her. He was drunk and we fought like hell. But who knows what wouldn't have happened if I hadn't been there. You make him show us his back. And you will see who's lying. I'm sorry, Colonel. This shit is just so crazy. <clears throat> Turn him. <clears throat> you wear the image of Cerberus, the Hound of Hades. How fitting that you were discovered ascending from the underworld. But you are not. Cerberus, are you? Deacon St. John. He's lying. You hide behind Never angelic names! And Claudius is a lie! He's not kicked out you of You are Judas! And what about you, Lieutenant? Ha! 
how convenient that you were with the Drifter when the Nero helicopter came by. Colonel, I do not know what you're talking about. You were in a Nero camp that was overrun. How long have you been spying on us? How long? Matt, I promise, I haven't been- My eyes! I expect this from Drifters. I expect men like him to betray me! The officer? Colonel. It was me! Uh, it was me! Colonel, I lied. If you look in my pocket, you're gonna find a radio. Because I called them. I called them and I lied. I lied to the lieutenant. I told her that, uh, I needed her to help me check a shipment, but truth is, I just needed a hostage. Deacon St. John, Drifter, are you there? This is Nero. This is O'Brien, Drifter. I'm sorry. Corporal St. John is unavailable right now. Wait. Who is this? Sometimes, in the search for truth, the blood of innocence is spilled. Sorry, my dear. Release Private uh, Zakowski, was it? Yeah. And Corey, take this drifter to lock up. Tomorrow at 0700, he will stand trial. And he. Enough of this. We have work to do. Come. Tell me more about this lost lake camp. Yes, sir. Anything you want to know. Lieutenant! Good. I thought I heard you breathing. Oh, fuck you. That's what I want to hear. It means the shit hasn't broken you yet. <clears throat> okay. Why? Tat on your back. A dead dog chewing through its chains? That's something you see every day. <clears throat> I did some digging before we freed you. I was, um, I don't know, trying to make sense out of it. This was taken from the lieutenant when she came into the camp. My guess is, it's yours. Yeah, it's mine. And your wife's name? It ain't Beth. No, it ain't. And you've been out here all this time? Trying to find her? Yeah. You just asked me why. <laughs> Pretty simple, really. The way I figure it, any man who goes through God knows what to find his old lady does not deserve to die at the end of a row. Wait, wait, wait a second. You're, you're, you're helping me? Well, that, that just means you're all gonna hang. We're not going back. The colonel is batshit crazy. <laughs> Holy war, genocide, I mean, what the fuck is that? Yeah, well then, what's the plan? What are you gonna do? We're going east. Yeah. Hopefully we can make it to Reno. You should come with us. Nope. Well, you can't go back. The militia will shoot no, you on I'm sight. No, I'm not leaving without her. Uh, and I gotta ride north. I gotta warn Iron Mike. It's way too late for that now. Why? Well, they spent all night clearing the Santiam Pass. What? A convoy rode out early this morning heading north. Oh, shit. Are you sure you don't?
come with us. Yeah, I'm sure. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Hey, uh, uh, Corey. When I told the Colonel about my military service, I told him I hated every goddamn minute of it, but, uh, maybe it wouldn't have been so bad if... if I'd served under someone like you. You know, maybe it's not too late. I gotta get back to Lost Lake. I gotta head north. I gotta save Boozer. Ricky, Iron Mike, and I, I, can't, I can't save Sarah. I can't save Sarah, but I can save them. I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry. But I am not giving up. I'm gonna find a way. I'm gonna come back for you. I swear to God. I am coming back for you. I gotta head north. Take the, uh, Sandium Highway. It's clear now. Yeah, it's fast.
Come <laughs> on. 